Oh, wait, pause, time out, stop. Sure, jump in there. Um, The University of Miami got a 2020 football commitment the other day. Thank you. I completely forgot about that. Uh, The kid's name is Darren Branch. He's from Amite, Louisiana, uh, which is the same high school that Devontae Smith, the wide receiver for Alabama, attended. Um, The wide receiver who was going to come on an official visit to Miami all the way up until he didn't. Um, That was a kind of crazy story because uh, two days or the day before he was scheduled to come to his official visit in January that year, um, he was interviewed after a basketball game. Devontae Smith was. And we were like, okay, cool. So you're going to Miami this weekend? And he was like, "Uh, I don't know, maybe. And he didn't. He goes to Alabama and he's, you know, doing numbers over there, obviously. Uh, But anyway, uh, Darren Branch uh, wrote a welcome to the U piece on him. He uh, committed yesterday um, being uh, the 19th, I believe. And uh, yeah, so he is a six foot two defensive back um, with long arms Um, and he could play. He's most places listed as a corner, but some people think that he could be a better safety. Uh, so, and then even, you know, I saw, uh, Andrew Ivins from two, four, seven sports was talking about the fact that, um, branch might even grow into a striker, uh, which is, you know, that kind of hybrid outside linebacker position for Miami down in the future. Um, so yeah, um, he is, uh, he's a three-star recruit. Uh, he's like six, 280 pounds, um, running in like the four sixes, like mid four sixes right now. Uh, but you know, guys get faster over the course of time. Like Sheldrick Redwine was the four seven guy in high school, and then he tested at four 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 in the NFL Combine. So you can get faster. Uh, but yeah, so Darren Branch is the tenth commitment to Miami's uh, recruiting class, which is currently ranked three nationally. Uh, he's the third defensive back joining Ladarius Tennyson from Rockledge, Florida, and Jaden Francois, who tied a Dade County record with twelve interceptions as a junior for South Dade uh, last year. Um, so he's the third defensive back in that class. Uh, and yeah, I mean, you're looking for big dudes who can move. So he's six, two with a big wingspan and, you know, uh, pretty good hips, uh, you know, so fluid, uh, athletic ability and things like that. So yeah, you know, I, I personally am not the biggest fan of this take, uh, of branch. I, I think that you can get similar or better locally. Um, but you know, if the staff is really, really trusting their evaluations and they say, no, this is a guy that we want. And, you know, there was some talk about that when he got his offer. He visited uh, March 1st, uh, an unofficial visit. That's when he got his offer. And there's a guy on Twitter who's like stomping for him to get an offer. And I just I didn't see it. Um, and yeah, so like less than three weeks later, he's committed, uh, which shows you that he was pretty high on Miami's board. If he got offered and they're pushing for and will accept a commit at this time. So um I will say that there is a disconnect between my beliefs and the staff's beliefs uh, about Branch, but you know I will have to defer to them at this point. So we will see uh, how he goes and how he develops and things uh, as he plays uh, through the seven on seven season in this spring, uh, because seven on seven is a thing that people do, you know, spring and summer, uh, and then obviously as a senior year. But uh, yeah, so I mean, there's another big DB on the board uh, for Miami. There's ten players overall in that class. Uh, written. Uh, the welcome to the U pieces for all of them and everything will be adding on to that. So, you know, yeah, that, uh, you know, with Miami looking to take another 25 guys this year, um, you've already had the attrition of Cade Weldon. So that opens up a scholarship, um, for next year, excuse me. And, uh, yeah, I think uh, when I wrote the numbers breakdown piece, I said that like six or seven guys on the roster currently, we're going to have to, uh, seek uh, opportunities elsewhere for Miami to get to that 25 number. So we've already had one of those guys and then we'll see what happens obviously through and after this upcoming season. But yeah, Darren Branch, welcome to the U and uh, we'll see what happens uh, through this spring and summer and his senior year uh, as you know, we obviously continue to watch him because you know, he's a Canes commit.